have a number of incidents, some of them ongoing. And what's not clear is whether they are, are linked. Um, we do know that uh, there were gunfire and explosions reported um, in streets close to the Massachusetts Institute of Technology um, after a police officer w was shot dead there. That's one or two uh, witnesses uh, there. And um, people there, the reporters there and eyewitnesses have said one person may have been shot in the battle, um, the gun battle that went on there. So it's clearly uh, a, a police officer who has been shot and killed. What the pictures we're seeing on local television are of what we think is a gunman lying on the ground. That's not clear whether he's dead or whether he's um, uh, being held there and forced to uh, lie immobile and uh, lying on the ground. So that's not clear. What is also going on in, the, in a similar area, but not exactly in the Massachusetts uh, Institute of Technology area, this is going in in Watertown, is, is a huge police operation. And what's reported to be present there, as well as um, a lot of police, are FBI units and Homeland Security units. Now, that's interesting because they wouldn't normally be called in for the shooting of a policeman. They would be called in if there was some kind of terrorist activity or some other event that would draw in federal agents. So that's led to some speculation that what's going on out there may be linked to the investigation into the Boston bombing.